until mid-2021. Now let's get to Deirdre Bosa with the latest for us. Deirdre? Hey, Kelly, that's right. Google and Silicon Valley now at large. They were early to send workers home. Now Google's the first to tell employees you don't need to come back for a year. Now, the decision applies to nearly all of the 200,000 full-time and contract employees across Alphabet. It allows them to sign full-year leases elsewhere if they choose to do so. It also allows families to plan for uncertain school years. In an email to staff, Pichai wrote, I hope this will offer the flexibility you need to balance work with taking care of yourselves and your loved ones over the next 12 months. Question now is, Kelly and Bill, do other tech companies follow? Apple and Amazon, they extended their work from home policies until early 2021, while others like Twitter and Facebook are making some remote work permanent. Now, Alphabet's move here is different in the sense that it's not committing to remote work forever, but it is giving employees an entire year to plan for it. It may also suggest that one of the world's biggest companies is preparing for a long pandemic. And as we've discussed lots on this network, that could have important implications for housing markets and for the future of cities and urban areas. Back over to you. Speaking of which, I mean, let's face it, uh, here in New York City, Google had been gobbling up uh, a lot of the west side real estate there as their, their sort of footprint grew. Amazon was starting to do the same thing. But I'm, I, I suspect, and I know my son works in an industry where they find that they can be just as productive from home as they are uh, in, in an office environment. And you just wonder what the long-term implications are for those moves that were already underway for companies like Google and Amazon. Absolutely. And where I live and work, San Francisco, there's a lot of startups as well that have decided, look, we don't need to pay this much for real estate. Let's just pack up or you know, scale back real estate plans that they did have. So uh, you're certainly seeing it on both sides of the country, Bill and Kelly. That is for sure. Deirdre Bosa in San Francisco. Thank you.